come give me something on uh, She usually wears these underneath her uniform um, What's up YouTube? Welcome back to my um, to my channel Those of you that are new that are watching that is watching my video Man, I can't even talk because of these freaking things right here. Yes, I got braces. Why my adult ass got braces? Because I want to close these two gaps right here on my teeth. Um, I'm not going to talk too much about my braces because I'll do a separate. I'm going to do a separate video on um why I got braces, how much the braces cost me, how long I have to wear them, and problems that I'm having. Um, right now. I will address the problem that I am having right now is that there's these little things right here they have a little hook and it's just scraping my tongue right here not my tongue it's scraping the inside of my um of my lip and I guess those are for rubber bands but I don't think I will be wearing rubber bands because I don't have a problem with my with my bite meaning that my bite is not off when I bite down, my teeth do come together and they are, they meet. So anyways, um, so let's get into what I'm going to do today. Today's video is going to be a Forever 21 haul and it's going to be a collective haul, meaning that I did not buy these all in one trip. I bought them within, actually pretty close together because I bought them within, um, I want to say within two to one to two to three weeks. Um, I went in store today and bought some things. So I just decided to um, combine um, the video into one. And when you see the try-on portion, you will see them that they were done at different times. So anyways, let's get right into it. Um, my first item that I purchased was a bodysuit. And it's just a bodysuit like so. And the bodysuit was $12 in, oops, sorry. It was $12.90 and I got it in a 2X. Okay, and then, um, let's see. I bought another dress. So, oh, here it goes. So this is like an, a halter dress. It was just so cute on. I just really fell for this dress when I saw it. And it has some ruching, not ruching, some elasticity in the back. And it's pretty, sh it's not short, short, but um, it looks really cute on and you'll see in the try-on portion. I got this in a 2X and this was $24.90. So these are items that I actually bought today. Um, I went to Santa Cruz this weekend and um, they, in downtown Santa Cruz, they have a little shopping area and we decided to go um, downtown and uh, look at what they had at Forever 21. They did have a lot of stuff that was on sale. All their clearance was additional 50% off. So I did get some of my stuff additional 50% off. Okay, and then um, the next item I got was, uh, it's just a little t uh, simple t-shirt, and it just says the Rolling Stone, and it has their tongues in all different, I want to say, different flags. Yeah, and I just thought it was really cute, simple, and it fits like this top right here. So I actually got this top from um, Forever 21, and it just says Calabasas on it, and I just like the fit of the tee. This tee was only $10.90, um, and you'll see it, um, you'll probably see me doing the try-on portion with this on, but I actually packed this in my bag to wear. So anyways, and then this top, um, how much is this top? This top was $12, oh no, $17 a night, damn, $17, I didn't know it was $17, I wouldn't have bought this shirt if I knew it was $17, and I got it in a 2X, I thought it was $10.90, I think I got it confused with another tag, um, but I like it, it's cute, but I would not spend $17 on, almost $20 on a t-shirt, that makes no sense at all, okay, and then also in this trip, I also end up buying this dress here, and this dress I did get on clearance, um, I ended up getting this in a 3X, it was $9, and actually it was exactly $9, and it was 50% off, so I got it for, um, I guess, $4.50. So it's just like a sheer dress, um, it is long sleeve, and it is lined with a slip underneath, and it's like midi, not too much of a midi le length, but it goes right below my knees, and you'll see how it looks on the try-on portion, and these were all done in dressing room. My try-on portion will be inside the dressing room, Okay. And then, okay, and then um, when we were on the Santa Cruz boardwalk, um, 
they have stores where you can buy all kind of stuff and um, I got this cute little champion um, long sleeve tee and it just says Santa Cruz on it and then it has a champion here I believe this is probably a men's uh, top because it is in a size large right here large it was $29.99 and then it just this is authentic champion gear okay and then also while we were downtown in downtown Santa Cruz um they have an urban outfitter okay and what does this say the bag says pride won't hide they always have little cute slogans or cute little colorful bags when you buy things from um urban outfitters so I actually wasn't even going to go into Urban Outfitters because I, my nieces were with me and they wanted to go into this candy store called It's Sugar. And I bought all kind of candies and I am so bad because I know good and goddamn well I can't eat that this shit with my braces. But guess what? I'm going to find a way. I have my back, my molars. There's no braces on my molars so I will find a way to eat that candy. Anyways. So, um, like I said, so we went to which, uh, It's Sugar and I got my niece's candy and stuff like that. And then um, my mom and my sister were in there for a while, so I ended up going in there waiting for them. And I said, my mom's like, oh, they have additional 30% off of their clearance. Um, and my mom was just showing some stuff. I said, oh, let me just go look over there and see what they have. And I looked up. So, um, they didn't have a lot of stuff in my size, um, but I found some Adidas stuff. And you'll see on in the try-on portion, I had a whole bunch of Adidas stuff. Uh, I ended up only getting two things because um, the other item did not fit me. And yeah, two items didn't fit me. But anyways, I like really, really, really came up. So I found this top right here. And it's just a crew, a crew sweater. And I guess it's like an oversized or I guess it's supposed to be long. But this isn't a size large. It's like in a mint green. And it isn't a size large. And this was $49.99, and they had additional 30% off. But, let me tell you, when I got to the cash register, um, she scanned my items. And it was so funny because my mom told me that the, um, the Urban Outfitters um, in San Francisco, where we go to, had additional 40% off on all of their sale items. So, when we got to the cash register, um, she rang this up. And I kid you not, it came up as seventeen dollars and ninety ninety seventeen ninety nine or seventeen ninety eight. However, they priced their um, clearance stuff, their cents. But anyways, but yeah, came up to seventeen dollars and eighty nine cents. I was like, what? Oh my gosh! So yeah, it's like, oh, I'm for sure getting this. And actually, I was gonna give it back to her because I wasn't gonna buy it, but it was still in my hand. And then I got this beauty right here so freaking cute I had my eyes on this for the longest time I think actually oh I do I was like oh in my drawer I have this matching print tank that I bought and I showed you guys that in my other um forever I mean my other uh Adidas haul or whatever I did but anyways I just love that print and I wish I could have found the pants but they didn't have pants in my thighs the leggings and this was like way out of my price range because this was a hundred dollars okay a hundred dollars Guess how much this rang up as? $17.98 or 89 cents. Can you believe that? My goodness. And the thing about this one, I did get this in a size large. And you guys can see I showed you the tag inside the um inside the dressing tram. Look at this. It's reversible. Reversible. Oh my gosh, this is like a win-win two jackets in one and I don't have a black Adidas jacket like so so I was just in awe and guess what on top of the $17.98 or $89 <coughs> I had a $5 coupon for because I, I think I mentioned before in Urban Outfitters when you buy things you just have them scan your um scan your little rewards thing and it doesn't go about it doesn't go the thing I like about um, Urban Outfitters is it doesn't go by the amount that you spend it's however many times you come in and purchase something so my mom uses the same app <coughs> and um, so when she buys stuff too um, she has my information on her app so I get like double the times that it gets scanned so anyways those two items end up costing me $32 they end up being $14.99 each and 
you'll see that I tried on the pants and I wish I could have fit the pants but had I known that those pants would have probably came up to the same amount excuse me the $17.89 or whatever I would have just bought them in like resold them on Poshmark or went online found an extra large and rebought them and then um swap them out somehow um yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed that um my forever 21 collective haul and my little stuff from urban outfitters um so i will see you guys in my next video remember to comment like and subscribe and what else i want you guys to do um you can leave comments questions um i will go ahead and link the items that i purchased in my um, description box in case anybody wants to go ahead and pick those items up and get there's another website that has Adidas stuff for super cheap as well, and it's called Hibbet. It's H-I-B-B-E-T-T. -T. Um, I don't know where they're located. I think they had one in L.A., but I've been by, I've been lucking up and finding a lot of Adidas stuff on sale real cheap, and even Nike and stuff. They have every single brand. It's almost like a dick sporting good, but I think people don't, a lot of people don't know about it, I guess. I know they have in stores, like, um, places, um, not inside of, um, not inside of, I mean, not in California, but other places I went online actually not online I went on uh, YouTube to check out the um the website to make sure that it was legit or whatever because I bought my bought my daughter some Jordans from that website so I just wanted to make sure that it was legit and it, sure enough it was um yeah so anyways I know I said that I was in or not that I said I was in it but I know I was like okay comment like surprise bye I'm out of here but for real I'm out of here this time and I will definitely see you guys in my next video um I'll try to have my next video uh, to be about my braces and I need to stop talking because I'm just scratching up my lips inside so like I said I'll see you guys in my next video and that's it bye okay this is just my outfit of the day everything is actually from Forever 21 this top here that says Calabasas my jeans, Forever 21, sweater, Forever 21, but my shoes do not match, and those are actually from Steve Madden. This top here, um, I just thought it was cute, uh, Rolling Stone, I assume these are all the cities, or not cities, or states, or world that they toured, and it's in a 2X, I just thought it was a cute tee. There's a black bodysuit, simple, nothing special, um, but I just thought it was cute. It's a ribbed one as well. Probably wear it underneath some overalls or something. Right here is like a mesh um, tan bodysuit too, but I did not like that at all. It did nothing for me, I feel. Yeah, so that was a no go. Didn't like that. Okay, so this dress right here I thought was just um, really cute. Um, basic black dress. Um, and it's very thin material. It's actually see through. Um, and it just had a black slip underneath it. Um, and it made it even better is it was only $4.50. So I scored on that one. Yep. I it was so cute right in here. This halter dress was so freaking cute. I really, really like that. Um, of course, I gotta get a push up bra so my boobs aren't hanging. But, anyways, um, yeah, I just thought that was really cute. Of course, to wear with a strapless bra. Yeah. These right here, these are pants I really, really, really liked, um, but they didn't fit. Um, those were a 0x, but I really love the cut and the fit of them. I end up going online and finding them in my exact size and order them. I'm in Urban Outfitter and I came across some Adidas stuff that they had on their clearance and um, I really, really love these pants. Only thing is that they were way too tight. There was no stretch in them. They were lined because they were, um, they were reversible. Alright, and here's an Adidas crew neck uh, sweater and this is in a size large and I believe it was supposed to be like a long oversized fit but for me since it is in a large it just fits like a regular crew neck tee green and then here is the matching jacket that went with the um the pants I so wish I could have fit those pants and the jacket is reversible as well um and I got that in a size large <laughs>